Um, we're going to analyse Collins Bike Repair Shop cash flow. We're going to look carefully at the figures and see if we can spot what's been going on. So first of all, have we noticed that he had in February a big increase in his inflows? Now, that was due to him taking a loan out. So in actual fact, if we take that out, there wasn't much of an increase at all. So it may look slightly better than it was. Borrowing money is good for the business, but only if you're spending the money on something for the future. So might not be that great. Secondly, if we look here, the rent figure has gone from 300 to 1,000. So they might have moved to bigger premises. Perhaps they did. Their sales went up slightly. We'll see what happens. The next thing, if we look down here, that their net cash flow is negative 1,875. Now, we've talked about the rent going up, but that is a much bigger increase than just the rent. So if we look back, we can see that their stock figures have gone up a lot. So their negative cash flow is because they paid more on rent and more on stock. So this leaves us with a closing balance, which is negative in March. And Colin will need to do something about that in the future. And yes, they were motorbikes.